This week on Fox Sports West, the Angler Chronicles crew shifts gears and does something a little different. Imperial Valley is our destination as Sergio and friends go hunting out of Woodlands Hunt Club. Greg Boslog with On Target Range is also with us today to make sure we have a fun and safe hunting experience. We are also going to visit On Target, Orange County's premier 25-yard indoor range in Laguna Niguel. Fun and exciting as well as educational for all the Angler Chronicles crew. Beautiful Imperial Valley with its lush green alfalfa fields provides the perfect venue for great pheasant hunting with our host, Woodlands Hunt Club. Sergio, Ron Hobbs, Captains Larry Moore and Rick Scott, the entire Angler Chronicles crew had a blast, pun intended, pheasant hunting in Imperial Valley. A busman's holiday indeed for all of our professional fishermen, but bird hunting this time, not fishing. And all of this is followed up with a pheasant feast at the On Target Range. Pheasant is one of the best tasting of all game birds and our crew agrees. Pheasant Fantastic is next on Fox Sports West. Angler Chronicles, proud to be sponsored by Owner Perfection in Hooks, Typhoon Polarized Sunglasses, and by Turner's Outdoorsman, your fishing, hunting, and shooting headquarters since 1971. Welcome everyone to Angler Chronicles on Fox Sports West. This week, Sergio and friends are going hunting. That's right, hunting, not fishing, and in the lush alfalfa fields of Imperial County. Our gracious hosts today are the fine folks at Woodlands Hunt Club, who you will get to meet a little later in our program. But right now, the boys are just having some fun getting ready for the hunt. So please stay with us. This is this is Sergio's. Hey, 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 hey! <laughs> yeah. This is yours, hey, Sergio. Sergio's got, look at this one. Yeah, shotgun shell. Who's gonna make fun of me when I'm holding this? Go ahead. Absolutely nobody. Seriously. <laughs> An entry level shotgun for for your family or something? They came out a few years ago. Excellent. Just excellent. Technology wise, yeah, it does get you better. Than this is a uh, this is your pump. When you shoot, bang, bang, bang. It's got fiber optics on the front of it. Safety is paramount on all hunting trips out of On Target Range and Woodlands Hunt Club. Right now, Greg Boslog is going over hunting safety tips. When you're shooting a sh shotgun, the 12 gauge typically is red. The 20 gauge is yellow. They leave the 20 gauge yellow on purpose because it fits inside a 12 gauge. It's almost perfect to fit down the barrel and jam the gun. So you want to be very, very careful. Now, unfortunately, they make 12 gauge shotgun shells in at least 10 different colors. So you can't say they're always red, they're always green, they're always black, they're always purple. Uh, you can't say that. 20 gauges up until just about a year and a half ago were always yellow. And then some foreign manufacturers started making them in some other colors. But I always like to keep yellow 20 gauge, red 20, red 12s, so that you don't get confused, you don't put the wrong shell in the wrong gun. Big time safety issue. You plug the barrel up with this, the gun will explode. So the difference between Greg and I is Greg's a 12 gauge shooter, I'm a 20 gauge shooter. Uh, the difference in the shells is you have 18% less in a 20 gauge than you do in a 12. So if you're a 20% better shot, than your brother, then you'll end up with more birds. So it's not that it happens all the time, but we'll see today. If you guys really want to see a good 20 gauge shooter, I'll be more than happy to help. They actually say that the 12 gauge, the BBs bounce against themselves, and when they do, they create holes. And the holes a duck can actually fly through. There's less and a better pattern in a 20 gauge than there is in a 12 gauge. And we're shooting fairly close, so 20 gauge is very effective. And that is, if it's not going away, left, right, do not come back. Just let it go. If you come back above 90, just stop. Because the only way you're going to be able to shoot is to turn around and we're all going to be behind you. So what we want you to do is anything goes out this way, left or right, that's fine. If there's two guys, we'll decide who gets left, who gets right. Okay. All right? And you guys have to decide that. You have to decide left or right. It's called field of, field of fire. You guys have to decide that. So if, uh, if it's Sergio and it's Rick, 
One gets left, one gets right, only in front. And you'll hear us in back behind you yelling, don't shoot, don't shoot. So pay attention to that too. Black is safe, there's no red. When you push that and you see the red, it's ready to fire, it's ready to pull the trigger. So you wanna look at it and make sure it's, red means it's ready to fire. So right now, Sergio, Greg, and his brother Brent and the Angler Chronicles crew are headed to the alfalfa fields of Imperial County. 10 o'clock, 10 o'clock, 2 o'clock, there's a rooster right there. Yeah, <laughs> and later in our episode, we're going to visit On Target Range in Laguna Niguel, California for fun as well as hunter education. Imperial Valley is our location this week, pheasant hunting. That's right, the Angler Chronicles crew has shifted gears and hunting this week out of Woodlands Hunt Club. Stay with us. Another bird coming up here. Pheasant hunting at Woodlands Hunt Club with On Target. We'll be right back. Welcome back to Angler Chronicles on Fox Sports West. This week, Sergio and friends are in Imperial Valley, California. And after Greg and Brent with On Target Range have provided everyone with a safety seminar, it's time to go pheasant hunting. Stay with us. Captain Rick Scott of the Ocean Odyssey in San Diego nails the first pheasant of the morning. There's a lot more action coming right up on Angler Chronicles. This week's episode is entitled Pheasant Fantastic and you will soon see why. So please don't go away. Ron Hobbs, co-director of the Owner Hooks Fishing Schools, is about to get a big surprise and get off a great shot. Take a look. Got another bird coming up here. Great. I've done it before. Hey, the dog's on the point. As you can see, the boys are off to a nice start this morning, enjoying great pheasant hunting in Imperial Valley. But right now, everyone is taking a bit of a water break and getting ready for another outing. We'll get right back to the hunt, but for now, let's go to Laguna Niguel, where Sergio is going to have a little chat with Greg Boslog with On Target Range. We created a place where people can go, have a great time, have a lot of training, good sophisticated technologies here so that we can offer women classes, boy classes, young, young people classes, boy scout classes, adult training. So we have all of that here that didn't exist before. And so we're expanding our, our ability to get out to the community. We offer all kinds of 
I'm going to call it charitable activities. We fundraise for the Marine Corps. We, we do fundraising for local other charities. So all of those things are the things that we now do that didn't exist before. On Target is Orange County's premier 25-yard indoor range. There's something for everyone, young and old alike. The aim for fun range is for children of all ages. Take a look. Now let's watch Rick Scott and Dina from the Ocean Odyssey in the big range, shooting the big guns. So don't touch the trigger until you've got the sights lined up, okay? All right? I don't want to shoot this thing. There you go. I want your upper body to absorb the blast, all right? Uh-huh. All right, put your hands a little bit higher. There you go. Don't go away, when Anger Chronicles returns, there's much more pheasant hunting action coming up from Imperial Valley and hunting with Mindel Woodland, owner of Woodland's Hunt Club. Also, later in our program, we will return to On Target Range where Sergio will chat again with owner Greg Boslog. You're watching Pheasant Fantastic on Anger Chronicles and only on Fox Sports West. Angler Chronicles. We'll be right back. <laughs> Welcome back to Pheasant Fantastic on Angler Chronicles. This week, Sergio and the Angler Chronicles crew are in Imperial Valley, California, and hunting with Woodlands Hunt Club. There's a lot more bird hunting action coming right up, so please stay with us. Hunting a beautiful, it's obvious to see it, but about 18 inch tall, almost two foot alfalfa field here in Imperial Valley, Woodlands Hunt Club. Thousands of acres of alfalfa in the Imperial Valley. Yep. Sergio got one on his first shot. I finally have a feather in my cap. And right now, let's go back to On Target Range and join Sergio and Greg Boslog. All the training for, for firearms, as far as uh, we have home defense for shotgun, we have pistol training, rifle training. We also have personal defense, which is um, uh, an expansion of the concealed carry permit that's going on, so personal protection outside the home. We also offer up just free personal protection without firearms, what's called a a, it's an NRA certified program that does not involve firearms, so it's personal protection. We offer all of that now because if people want to be afraid, we don't want to be afraid. We want them to be com confident that they're capable to defend themselves or protect themselves in some way, whether it's just knowing what kind of locks to use, what kind of place to put themselves in when they're out shopping. You know, where, where are you when you're shopping? Are you in the right place or the wrong place? So we, that's what we've done. We've created that whole venue. So if someone wants a firearm or someone that just wants awareness, we've got the whole span of training here for them. Of course, the Angler Chronicles crew are all avid sport fishermen. And every angler knows that you will not land every fish you hook up. The same thing goes for pheasant hunting. You will not get every bird that flies in front of you. Take a look. Go, 
again. If you're just now joining us, you're watching Angler Chronicles on Fox Sports West. And today's episode is entitled Pheasant Fantastic because the Angler Chronicles crew are experiencing great bird hunting in Imperial Valley, California. And when Angler Chronicles returns, Sergio will have a talk with Mendel Woodland, owner of Woodland's Hunt Club, with information about the club and hunting in this area of Southern California. Also, when we return, we will be going back to on target range, this time for a pheasant feast. So please stay with us. Folks, welcome back to Angler Chronicles on Fox Sports West. This week, Sergio and the Angler Chronicles crew are pheasant hunting out of Woodlands Hunt Club in Imperial Valley. This has been a little different experience for most of our fishermen, and right now it's Captain Rick Scott's turn. Great shot, Rick. And folks, if you're just now joining us, you're watching Pheasant Fantastic on Angler Chronicles. Please stay with us. Hold on, Serge. And folks, watch closely as Sergio nails his second bird of the day. Folks, hunting dogs, bird dogs, are an important part of the shoot. Almost impossible without them. And today, out of Woodlands Hunt Club, we're hunting with two German short-haired pointers and two English pointers. And their names are Casey, Rody, Hannah, and Mud. Right now, Sergio is having a little chat with Mendel Woodland, owner and operator of Woodlands Hunt Club in Imperial Valley. Mendel, we're here at Woodlands Hunt Club. Tell us about your operation. Well, we're here in Imperial Valley, Sergio. About 450,000 acres of farmland down here. We've got about 9,000 acres, six ranches. We do pheasant hunting, and three of them are just strictly dove ranches for hunting dove. But we've got great bird dogs if you don't have one. But if you got one, to me, that's the ultimate. If you got your own dog run out here. Alfalfa fields, Bermuda grass, some volunteer Sudan, which we're standing in right now. Just a lot of great different cover and miles of covered ditches. Your labs are welcome. They love that water. You know, you duck guys, it's good, good water ditches. Run your dogs, put up birds. And folks, as promised, when Angler Chronicles returns, it will be to a pheasant feast back at the on-target range. Don't go away. 
You're watching Angler Chronicles on Fox Sports West. We'll be right back. Angler Chronicles, proud to be sponsored by Owner Perfection in Hooks, Typhoon Polarized Sunglasses, and by Turner's Outdoorsman, your fishing, hunting, and shooting headquarters since 1971. And right now, back at the On Target Range in Laguna Niguel, it is time for that pheasant feast. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Is that what the Open her up there, look at that. Oh, that's nice steer. This is what I've been looking for to all week is this pheasant stew. It is excellent. The pheasant hunting was excellent. It was a good time. Everybody had a blast. <laughs> On behalf of Angler Chronicles, we want to thank Greg from On Target. Thank you. Brent from On Target. Thank you. You for putting the hunt together for us. You for cooking this meal that was just unbelievable. Pretty so we wanted to say thank you and salute to everybody. Salute. It was a great hunt.